Welcome back, everybody, to episode 5 of our Mass Effect 2 Legendary Edition playthrough. We are continuing on with our Renegade Fem Shep build, and our next step will be to go to Omega, and we're going to recruit some teammates as we are still in the recruitment phase of our Mass Effect 2 playthrough. Just to remind you, here are our powers and abilities, and of course you can see we are a level 4 infiltrator. And as you can see, of course, we have our Renegade bar completely, uh, that first section almost completely filled up because we imported our Mass Effect 1 save. So let's go ahead and land on Omega, open up our galaxy map here. And we are going to recruit the Veteran, which is a DLC character, Archangel, and the Professor, which are two of the main, the main base characters that we recruit in the game. Omega, built in the mined-out husk of a metallic asteroid, Omega has been a haven for criminals, terrorists, and malcontents for thousands of years. At times, the station has lain idle and abandoned for centuries, only to be reactivated by a new group of outlaws seeking a fresh start. Space Station's original elegant design has given way to a haphazard expansion by scabbling, scrabbling factions of every species. There is no central government or unifying authority on Omega, and nobody can recall a time there ever was one. Population, 7.8 million. Let's go ahead and dock. So far, I am very much enjoying the Mass Effect Legendary Edition playthrough. Let's take uh, Kasumi, because I've never actually used her before. She's also a DLC character. Let's take Kasumi and Miranda. Why not? I have a girl squad. So Kasumi has Overload, Shadow Strike, Cloak, and Sneak Behind a Target to deliver a devastating blow. I like that. Get her Overload, Master Thief. Kasumi's experimentation with her unique abilities increases her health and weapon damage. It also reduces the recharge time for powers. That'll be great. And Miranda doesn't have anything extra to offer. We've already leveled her up. Change squad weapons. I don't think we need to change weapons at this point. Uh, welcome to Omega. You're new here, aren't you? I can always tell. Allow me to... Oh, hello, Mocklin. I was just... Leave, Varget. Now. Oh, of course, Mocklin. Whatever she wants. Blasted scavengers. Welcome to Omega, Shepard. You know who I am? Of course. We <laughs> had you tagged the moment you entered the Terminus systems. You're not as subtle as you think. Aria wants to know what brings a dead specter to Omega. I suggest you go to Afterlife now and present yourself. I'll when I'm ready. Your boss when I'm damn well ready. Then you'd better get ready. No one keeps Aria waiting. Afterlife now. I'm receiving quarantine warnings about the slums where Dr. Morton Solis runs the clinic. Anticipate resistance at the transport station. I have also accessed messages between mercenary groups regarding plans to deal with the Archangel. There's a recruiting station at Afterlife that may have information on him. Alright, before we go ahead and get Morden and Garrus, we are going to get Zaid, who is a very quick character to recruit. He's a DLC character, similar to Kasumi. She was very, very easy to recruit. It's not really like we have to do a whole lot of missions to recruit them. So let's talk to Zaid. <laughs> Please, you have to help me. No one said you could talk, jackass. You Zaid Masani? Yeah, that's me. You must be Commander Shepard. I hear we have a galaxy to save. Uh, we do, but who's your friend? My contacts told me we're picking up one man, not two. Batarian delinquent. Pissed off someone rich enough to hire me to go after him. And for my bring him in alive rates, even. Please. I didn't do it. I said, shut it. 
<laughs> tried to leave me on a chase all over the systems. You should have known better. These people always run to Omega. This guy and me are going to get along real well because we're both renegades. What's next for him? What's going to happen to him? I'm going to turn him in for the bounty. Don't much care what happens after that. Okay, um, how much do you know? I assume you've been briefed? I've done my homework. Cerberus sent me everything I needed to know. What about you and Cerberus? What's your relationship with Cerberus? Easy. Cerberus is paying me a lot of money to help you on your mission. That's the long and short. Not many mercs would take a suicide mission for the pay. Most mercs don't get an offer like the one Cerberus sent me. This mission doesn't sound like good business, but your elusive man can move a lot of credits. Report to the Normandy. Go ahead and get set up on the Normandy. Right. I'll go make myself at home. I assume the elusive man told you about our arrangement. There's always a catch. I'm assuming there's some part of your contract that I'm expected to handle. That about right? Yeah. Funny he didn't tell you. Picked up a mission a little while back, just before I signed on with Cerberus. Thought you might be interested. You heard the name Vito Santiago. He's the head of the Blue Suns. Runs the whole organization. Seems he recently captured an Elfell Ashland refinery on Zoya and is using their workers for slave labor. The company wants it dealt with. We'll get to it if we can. Our mission takes priority. I know you've got bigger fish to fry. That's why I'd like to get this other thing dealt with as soon as possible. <laughs> nice try. I better turn this thing in before it starts to stink. I'll be locked and loaded next time you're ready to get some killing done. All right. Let's go to Afterlife. Talk to Arya. Come on, let me in. Arya's expecting This place looks just as good as it ever has. Aria. That's close enough. Stand still. Try it and you'll be scanning the inside of your colon. I'd almost pay to see that, but it's not <laughs> an option. You want to talk? You get scanned. All you had to do was ask. I don't ask. I was told you're the person to talk to if I have questions. They're clean. Depends on the questions. You run Omega? <laughs> I am Omega. Iconic. Iconic shot right there. But you need more. Everyone needs more something, and they all come to me. I'm the boss, CEO, queen, if you're feeling dramatic. It doesn't matter. Omega has no titled ruler and only one rule. Don't fuck with Arya. The writing. The writing in this game is out of this world. I have similar rules, Arya. Sounds like neither of us likes being jerked around. And on your ship, that would matter. Here, we entertain my preferences. Let's talk. So, what can I do for you? I'm trying to track down Archangel. You and half of Omega. You want him dead too? Why is everyone after him? He thinks he's fighting on the side of good. There is no good side to Omega. Everything he does pisses someone off. It's catching up to him. I'm putting a team together. He's on my list. Interesting. You're gonna make some enemies team up with Archangel. That's assuming you can get to him. 
Jake's in a bit of trouble. Just tell me how to find him. The local Merc groups are recruiting anyone with a gun to help them take down Archangel. That could be our way in. They're using a private room for recruiting. Just over there. I'm sure they'll sign you up. Tell me about him. Tell me about Archangel. Not as much as I'd like. He showed up here several months ago and started causing all sorts of problems. If you make your own laws, which everyone here does, he makes life difficult. He's reckless and idealistic. But he seems to know enough to stay clear of me. I appreciate the help. See if you still feel that way when the Mercs realize you're here to help him. Oh, we'll take out. We, we have no problem taking out Mercs. What about Morden? I'm looking for Morden Solus. Do you know where I can find him? The Solarian Doctor? Last I heard, he was trying to help plague victims in the quarantine zone. I always liked Morden. He's as likely to heal you as he is to shoot you. Sounds like my kind of guy. What can you tell me about him? Used to be part of the Solarian Special Tasks group. He's brilliant and dangerous. Just don't get him talking. He never shuts up. If you really need to find him, take a shuttle to the quarantine zone. No guarantee they'll let you in, of course. Tell me how you got set up here. That's as privileged as information gets. I have many friends and enemies I keep at varying distances. I don't count you among either. We'll see how useful you prove. Short answer, mind your own damn business. Okay. One scan and we're straight to business. People are usually more concerned about who I am. Your death was downplayed, but hardly what I call a secret. I had to make sure it was really you. You could have been anyone, anything. Whatever you need will come out on its own. I'm curious, but Omega doesn't really care about you. Oh, well, thank you, Arya. Maybe I'll come back later. Maybe I'll be here. All right, so we got those two quests started. Let's go ahead and talk to the Merc Recruiter. Paid when the job's done, just like everyone else. Who's next? Well, aren't you sweet? You're in the wrong place, honey. Strippers' quarters are that way. Show me yours, tough guy. I bet mine's bigger. Impressive. So Ooh. you're here to fight them. You could say that. Standard fee is 500 credits each. You Not paying that. The job's done. If you die, your friends don't collect your share. You'll need your own weapons and armor. Looks like you got that covered. And no, this does not make you a member of the Blue Sun's Eclipse of the Blood Pack. You are a freelancer, period. Any questions? Uh, I think I'm good. Where do we go? Just head over to the transport depot outside the club. One of our boys will take you from there. Send in the next one. Hey, is this where I sign up? This is it, but it's no game, kid. I grew up on Omega. I know how to use a gun. You'll need to know more than that if you want to survive. I can handle myself. Besides, I just spent 50 credits on this pistol, and I want to use it. If you're sure registration's in here, good luck. You'll need it. Perfect. Thanks. 50 credits on a gun? That thing is going to jam the first time you try to fire it. We took one look at that recruiter and he said strippers are that way. <laughs> uh, we had to we had to put him in his place, didn't we? Come on, let me in. Okay, let's go to the uh Let's see, where do we want to go? Omega, what a piss hole. At least it keeps you on your toes. I've had to come here on business before. I feel like I need a shower afterward, in addition to normal decontamination. I'm on the mission. I hope you're ready. Archangel's been annihilating you freelancers. 
Ready when you are. Get in. Let's go take care of Archangel first, and then we'll go get Morden. Let's take Zaid and Kasumi, because I still actually haven't fought with Kasumi. Let's uh, give these guys a spin. Concussive shot. Disruptor ammo. Very nice. Mercenary veteran. Zaid's long combat experience improves his effective health and weapon damage, of course. Oh, he has an Inferno grenade. Nice. It's about time they sent me someone who looks like they can actually fight. You bet. I'm ready to go. Is he with you? I'm on my own. I don't need any help. Just tell me where to go. Cocky right. son of a gun. Just head through there. I'm sure you'll find your way. I'm on it. He's gonna get slaughtered. They tell you what we're up against? Just tell us where to go. Archangel's holed up in a building at the end of the boulevard over there. He's got superior position, and the only way in is over a very exposed bridge. It's a killing ground. But he's getting tired, making mistakes. We'll have him soon enough. Now that I'm here, you will. I'll get to him. Just point me at that bridge. I like your attitude, but we've got a plan in place. You'll be on a distraction team. Head straight over the bridge and keep Archangel busy so the infiltration team can sneak in behind him. That's goddamn suicide. Pretty much. But you look like you can handle it. Head up to the boulevard and get to the third barricade. Talk to Sergeant Kathka. He'll tell you when to go in. Okay, well, this bridge, whole bridge plan sounds like a death run. So the bridge is the only way to his hideout? Exactly. Archangel collapsed all the underground passageways and sealed the doors to the lower levels. We've got teams digging, but it's taking too long. If they can get the gunship flying again, that'll help. But I'm hoping the infiltration team will finish the job and we can all go home. They were using a gunship to take out one guy? Yeah, and Archangel shut it down. He didn't destroy it, but he knew just where to hit it to disable it. It wasn't even a fair fight. At least not for us. <laughs> Damn. Tell me about Archangel. What do you know about Archangel? I'm the wrong guy to ask. I just do logistics. Tarek and the other Merc bosses have been dealing with him for a while now. But don't be surprised if they're not thrilled about talking to a freelancer. I better go find Sergeant Kathka. Good idea. Watch yourself on the boulevard. Archangel's killed dozens out there already. Getting in will be easy. Getting out should be fun. Let's worry about finding him first. Alright, let's roll. Let's roll, squad. Shepard, I've scanned the area, but I am unable to plot any other paths to Archangel. Guess we're going with the Mercs. The heavy mechs and gunship possess considerable firepower. Weakening them before leaving will improve your chances. Oh yeah, we'll do that for sure. As the Sabotage. First plane goes in, the infiltration team will attempt to take Archangel by surprise. Hey, Jareth. Do you need something? You lead the Eclipse? You figure that out by yourself? I'm Jareth. I run Omega's Eclipse. What do you need, freelancer? What do you know about Archangel? His life expectancy is shortening quickly. Is that it? Nobody seems to know anything about him. Look around, you'll learn what you need to know. He's smart, he's resourceful, and he's dangerous. But we've got him cornered, he won't be making fools of us much longer. Can I assist you further? Details. Where did he come from? Who is he? Even his team didn't know that. Maybe we'll know more once we have his body. Of course, it really won't matter then. I'll get going. Good idea. Message to Tarek. Tarek, I've spoken to Garm, and he and his men are on board. Assuming this operation is successful, we can count on high morale and extensive buy-in from the men. From the losses we've already taken, possibility exists that we won't have the men needed to continue on to the next objective. It's clear, though, that none of our organizations would be ready to move on Arya without the assistance of the other two. Jareth. Ah, Jareth. Jareth has a plan to take down Arya. 
Ezo smuggling accounts. Let's see, we need one with a white at the top, middle, and blue. Here we go. And then we need green. Green, white, green. This is the one. Another really good hacking minigame developed by Bioware. I'll take that element zero. Heavy mech diagnostic station. Let's go ahead and hack it. There we go. Targeting parameters reconfigured. Nice. Anyone who activates that thing will get blown the hell up. Yep. That's right. Better stay clear of it. Make sure it hits the, uh... Make sure it hits the enemies. Uh, before we go in here, what's in here? Oh, wait, never mind. This is... This is the actual... We, we have to go in here and talk first. Let's talk to Garm. You're in the wrong place, freelancer. You the blood pack leader? Name's Garm. That's all you need to know. I'm stuck here waiting till you freelancers are done playing war. Ask your questions and go. Tell me about Archangel. What do you know about Archangel? He's a pain in the ass. He's a Turian, which makes him slightly worse to look at than you. And he's brave till he realizes you're more than he bargained for. Sounds like you've had personal experience. He tried to take me down once. Waited till I was alone. Longest damn fight of my life, but I held him off till my men showed up. He wasn't so tough after that. We chased him over half of Omega. Almost had him, but the slippery bastard snuck away before we could pin him down. I should get going. About time. Okay, anybody else? Any other intel we can get in here? I'm a specter, and I pack in more firepower than any of you. So just chill out. Orange, white. Here we go. I go by the colors and the arrangement of the colors. Pretty easy minigame, but it does provide a tad bit of a challenge. Go. Some salvage. Blue Sun's That's weapon shipment. Nice. Blue Sun's gun running accounts. Power cells. Great. Excellent. Excellent. Blue Sun's trooper. Med station. I'll take that. Herrick. Excuses? Falcraft gotta get that gunship working, or he'll be next over that bridge. And get this freelancer out of here. I don't have time for this shit. What's your problem? You. Gentle, get this scum out of my face. Tarek, what's seen in your ass? Zaid. You know this asshole, Zaid? We <laughs> worked together once. Since when do you work for so little? Since when are you a goddamn madman? You talk, Angel. This guy's gonna kill me. Almost did already. That bad, huh? Worse. Look, Saeed. I gotta deal with this shit. Jinta, talk to these guys. Answer whatever questions they have. Good to see you. And who knows? Maybe you'll solve my problem for me. Anything's possible. Nice. Good thing you know him. 
Peric hates having to hire freelancers. He doesn't trust anyone outside the Blue Suns. You don't say. What can I do for you? That's really cool that Zaid gave us an in with Tarek. That's awesome. Tell me about Archangel. What do you know about Archangel? He's a Turian vigilante who thinks killing mercs is a fun way to pass the time. Other than that, he's a mystery. He shows up, usually at the worst possible time, and screws with our work. He can't die soon enough, if you ask me. It sounds like you got something out for this guy. Why do you hate him so much? He went after Tarek. At his home. Almost got him. Tarek's been on edge ever since, and he's making my life a living hell. Second guesses every damn thing I do. Getting the other Merc bands to help us shows you just how desperate he is. They're as bad as Archangel. Okay. We better get going. Good idea. Make sure you check in with Kafka. Um, maybe I should ask her about the gunship real quick. What do you need? Plan of attack is, I wonder if she'll talk about the gunship. What's Tarek gonna do if the infiltration team fails? To start, he'll shoot any freelancers that are still alive. After that, he'll let Eclipse and the Blood Pack take their shots. I suggested we work together, but he doesn't trust the other groups. What if Archangel survives all the attacks? Then you sons are on your own. That's why Tarek wants that gunship fixed so badly. But it won't come to that. Archangel's good, but he can't hold out that long. He's already been in there over a day. Yeah, get going. she did mention the good gunship. Idea. The sooner you guys get through, the sooner the job is done. What do you want, freelancer? Shut up. There's the gunship over there. Kathka's assistant. Kathka? waiting for us? The infiltration team is about to give us a signal. Archangel won't know what hit him. Got any questions? This may be your last chance. Uh, yeah, let's talk about this gunship. Are you gonna give us cover with the gunship? Uh, Tarek is the only one who flies her. Besides, she's not quite ready. That bastard Archangel gave her a beating last time she was out there. A few more tweaks, she'll be as good as new. Are you a mechanic? Why are you coordinating the attack and fixing gunships? I'm in the infiltration group. Our team coordinates with the gunship. I'm staying back to organize the freelancers and make sure the gunship's ready to go if we need her. So our plan is to jump the wall and head for Archangel's building? And try not to get killed too fast. You're only a distraction, as long as you're alive. You don't have to make it all the way across. Just keep Archangel watching that bridge. The infiltration team will do the rest. Okay. Are you leading the assault? Ha! <laughs> Tarek doesn't pay me to fight. I just plan the attacks and fix the damn gunship. You freelancers get the privilege of... Target is in sight. Where a go? Check. Bravo team! Go, go, go! Archangel's got quite a surprise waiting for him. But that means no more waiting for me. Let's take out this guy. Back to 100% before Tarek decides he needs her again. Take out this guy so he can't repair the gunship. Don't turn your back on me. Working too hard. Oh. Nice. That gunship is out. Doesn't look good for Archangel. We've got nothing better to do. Let's go. Kid's already down. Come on. We'll give these guys a surprise of our own. Kid yeah. Okay, let's uh 
try to cross here. Not get shot. 